I heard about the BFI Academy through my mum. I heard about the course through my teacher. My granddad found a leaflet about it. And I instantly wanted to sign up and do it. My favourite part of the course has been getting taught by like professional mentors. going through workshops um, and masterclasses in camera, sound, directing, producing, and it all went towards a two-day film shoot, which is today. Initially, it starts off as a horror film until right at the ending, where we try and just break all that tension with a bit of a comedic twist. The main idea that I contributed is the way that the demon is defeated at the end, which used a a little bit of bad science based on a lot of good science. We managed to get hold of um, this place, which has been an abandoned school for quite a while now. Hey Denise, it's me. We're here outside the school. I've had to bring my sister with me. Bloody babysitting. But we can just lock her in a cupboard or something. My name's Rachel and yesterday I was directing. The main priority is taking care of the actors, making sure they're alright, if they're happy with the scene and they're the only ones that can actually speak to an actor if they think their performance needs tweaking in any way. One of the biggest challenges was that there was a group of three of us. So when we had to come to a conclusion about something we had to do on set, like a certain camera angle for a scene we were doing, we did have conflicting ideas, but ultimately we came up with what we thought was the best response as a team. I really enjoy doing makeup in general, so I thought working for the art department would be a really good way to kind of improve my skills. In the art department today, we have been making this sign. I'm interested in the art department because it allows you so much freedom and creativity of what you make. It lets you take the image you have for the film and make it a reality. I'll be playing the demon tomorrow. And I'll be getting a lot of liquid latex around my face with bits of tissue paper to act as decaying skin. They'll cover me in fake blood and I'll look like a Scary demon. <laughs> but yeah, that's it. Oh, oh, he's bowing. I find lighting interesting because it's crucial for the set. I have to go around the sets, learn about different kinds of lights, different bolts, how everything connects together, different um, stands, how to attach to the ceiling. So our job for the last sort of half hour or so has been pre-lighting the next scene so that as soon as that scene's wrapped the, the crew can move into the next location. My name is Tegan and I was in the sound department. I held the boom mic and monitored the sound recorder to make sure dialogue was heard. My role is to control the camera, decide how the shots will work. Oh, Jesus, why the hell are you creeping up on me like that? During the edit session, we had all the rushes shown to us. The main thing you should look for is performance rather than continuity. And just try and find a way to put clips together that feels natural to you and what you feel's right. My name is Kira Baxendale and I play Josie, who is the sister of Alex. I'm Charlotte Dawson and my character is Alex. Josie doesn't really get on well with Alex. She just sort of ignores her a bit and doesn't really think about her feelings because she's so obsessed with this guy, Denis, who is very attractive. My name is Carl Hughes and I play Dennis, or Denny. Don't worry, I'm all right, I'm fine. I was hiding in my cupboard. Jesus, we were in trouble, Dennis. Uh, it's Denny. I've worked on a lot of crew sets. The energies have gone down and everyone here, maybe because they're younger, I don't know, but I thought you were better than the professional people I've worked with, so. People have taken to it very instinctively, I think. 
there's a good focus. It's exactly the kind of right level of kind of people enjoying themselves, but also being very focused on getting a good product. My favourite experience so far has been meeting like-minded people and working together with them. I'm hoping to like pursue my careers in cinematography, directing and editing and try and make the most out of each of them. It's good to see uh, people coming into the business and learning the craft. It's great.